demonstrate how to perform a venny puncture using a vacutainer system. Now the vacutainer system uses a, vac uses a vacutainer adapter and a vacutainer needle along with the vacutainer tubes. So the first thing I'm going to do is of course identify your patient, check for allergies, um, and then the first thing we're going to do is actually uh, find a vein, place the tourniquet about three to four inches above the puncture site, that, and we're going to be sticking somewhere in the bend of the arm, it's called the AC, and I'm going to find the vein and I'm going to establish three things the center of the vessel, the direction that it goes, and how deep I think it is. Remember to landmark it so you remember where to go because after you prep it with alcohol, you can't touch it again. So now I'm going to take my uh, cotton ball, and my first cotton ball, and I'm going to prep the skin using small to larger circles, apply firm pressure, clean, up, clean off all that surface debris. We're going to give that 30 seconds to dry. While that's drying, we can go, in and go ahead and assemble our supplies. So we're going to take our vacutainer needle, hold it here at the base of the pink safety adapter, and then you're going to twist the bottom cap off. You'll see that seal break and pull it away. Now remember, underneath there is a needle, so don't, uh, don't touch that. But we're going to place the male adapter into the lure of the, of the uh, I'm sorry, the male uh, side of the needle into the lure of the adapter. Okay? Make sure it's nice and firm because you don't want that to slip off as you're getting ready to draw blood. Okay, so we'll take our first tube, place it in the back end, I'll push it all the way through, and that's actually ready to go. I have my tape and my cotton ball ready to go. Okay, so now that it's been 30 seconds, we're going to have the patient come forward just a little bit. Uh, we're going to place the tourniquet above, three to four inches above the puncture site. Remember not to let the tourniquet touch your puncture site. Have the patient keep the elbows straight and make a tight fist. And at this point, I want you to stand up, pull this safety device back, and then we're going to just simply uh, loosen that cap. Remember not to, um, not to touch the needle. Again, the, ne the bevel of the needle has to be facing up. Notice how I'm holding the adapter with three fingers and a thumb, but I use my pinky to steady the tube so it doesn't fall out. Okay, so I'm just pressing the, the, the tube uh, up against the inside wall of the adapter. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and pull the skin tight, and again, we're gonna approach the, the vein the way an airplane approaches a, one a runway. Ma'am, you're going to fill a stick in one, two, and three, and then just drop in. Now, once you're in, stop and anchor down. Notice how my fingers, these fingers are anchored down to her arm. We're going to take our thumb and index finger, and we're going to pop the tube in. Notice how I'm pushing the tube, but I'm holding that flange with the other hand. And I'm going to pull it out. Notice how I'm placing my fingers on the tube and the flange. We're going to pop another one in. We're going to use our thumb on the butt end of the tube and use our index finger on the flange of the adapter pop it in and pull it out. Okay, we're going to pull the tourniquet, grab our cotton ball, and we're going to pull the, ne <clears throat> excuse me, the needle out, and with one hand we're going to use the table to activate the safety device. Okay, and throw that away. <clears throat> now in this case the patient doesn't want tape, but if the patient does you would put the tape on. Uh, at this point you would then label your tubes and, um, and then show them to me. Now remember that when you're putting your tube into the adapter as you're getting ready to draw the blood out, the tube label should always be facing down so that you can actually watch the blood fill in. If the tube label is, fill, is facing up, it's going to be difficult to see the blood fill up the tube. Okay? Alright, thank you very much.